Hey everyone and welcome back to Tech Steve Dharma English YouTube channel. Today we're diving into brand new Firebase version 21, codenamed Sunlight Epiphany. It's packed with new features, accessibility improvements, and under the hood updates. If you've used Firebase before or you've been curious, stick around because I'll walk you through everything what's new, what works well, and what I watch out for. Let's get started. First, a little context. FIDOS is a Chromium OS based operating system like Chrome OS, often used for lightweight laptops, Raspberry Pi, hybrid devices, etc. The version 21 update is named Sunlight Epiphany and upgrades the Chromium OS base from R123 to R138, bringing newer security patches and performance enhancements. According to the official release note, this is more than just a patch, it introduces several user visible features, refinements, and work fixes. Let's break it down. Here's where you showcase and demo each major changes. Enhance the launcher search with filtering. First step, improve the launcher search. Previously, it search and get a big mixed list. Now, FireWest version 21 supports filtering by categories like apps, files, etc. This makes it faster to narrow down your result instead of shifting through everything. It's a small change, but one of those usability boosts that I will appreciate what they'll use. Next step, the quick insert panel. Press Windows or Command plus F and a panel pops up letting you search and insert emojis or read content directly into text or document. It's a noise convenience for when you're chatting or writing notes or designing something that creates a visual player quickly. This one is very cool. We gave it C notes later. After capturing a screenshot, FireOS gives you the option to copy text from screenshot, OCR, or search selected content directly on Google. That means if your screenshot a quote or code snip, you can instantly pull text or lock it up. Note, this requires Google account login to work. For enterprises or public setup, FireOS version 21 introduces isolated web apps when in CoISC mode, this run in sandboxed, isolated environments to enhance security. Use public CoISC, public terminals, or deployments where you only want to expose a single app interface. FireOS version 21 doesn't just focus on new flashy features, it also brings enhancements or accessibility. A few highlights mouse keys, control the cursor using keyboard, great alternative if using a physical mouse insert, bounce keys. Prevent repeated illustrations of a single press, hand timer friendly. Slow keys, adds a delay before a quick press is accepted. It's probably avoid accidental input. These features can be enabled on a settings accessibility. Of course, versions are also about stability. Version 21 addresses several bugs and optimization. Fix screen discolorization issues on some Intel Slum devices. Result a bug that prevented FireTap Duo from connecting to WPS pre weapon networks. Optimize the touchpad experience on FireTap 2. Those fixes help pull the experience on hardware where FireOS is deployed. This is key to maintain trust. Explain what isn't perfect yet. Before you dive in, here's are some important notes and keybase from the official release. Android Subsystem G Apps issue. On the Intel modern variant, Android Subsystem Data Restoration is not supported. Also, updating after installing G Apps. Melee the Play Store or certification errors. Developers mode and system integrity. In versions V18 Plus, developer mode is disabled by default. There are system integrity changes. Laptops sleep, late issues. Some laptops may not work after late close. Background disable sleep when a late is closed and a settings device power. We use command line fix. Edition incompatibility. Since we submitted, Different FireOS editions data exchange isn't supported, so upgrading across editions may be problematic. Raspberry Pi. The boot flash may not show in default KMS mode. Proke Apple not yet supported in KMS. First login might lag while setup completes. Android apps may crash if may are open. Hibernation is disabled. Microsoft Surface. When the Surface Go 3, Pentium Berlin is fully optimized. Some drivers, touch, camera, or experimental or limited. Always check the official notes linked in video description before upgrading or installing your hardware. Overall, FireOS V21 is sold a step forward. The new source filtering, quick insert, and screenshot OCR feature elevates usability. 
Accessibility enhancement shows that the team is paying attention to it closely. That said, the hardware limitations and Android G apps credits mean it's not a perfect release across all devices. But as long as you check compatibility, it's well worth creating or testing on unsupported hardware. Final verdict. For power users and deployers, Bison 21 is a meaningful upgrade. For casual users, it adds polished and useful tools without being disrupted. If you found this breakdown helpful, give the video a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. I'll drop links in the description include the official firewish, Bison 21 release notes, and hardware compatibility pages. Let me know in the comments if you've tested FireWorks version 21 on a machine, what works, what doesn't. I love the hearing experience. Until next time, happy exploring and see you in the next one.